Ladies and gentlemen, good morning. The Michigan High School Athletic Association and Royal Oak High School welcome you for today's 2022-23 baseball district tournament, Division One. And between two rivals across Woodward Avenue, the Berkeley Bears, who will be the visitors on the scoreboard uh, after a pregame coin toss, and the Royal Oak Ravens. Now let's meet the teams, the starting lineups, beginning first with the Bears. Uh, the Bears of head coach Matt Rollick. In the leadoff position, number four, catching, Spencer Baez. Batting second and at shortstop, Davis O'Donnell. Batting third and at second base, number five, Matt DeRozier. Batting fourth in, in the DH, number nine, Aiden Russell. Batting fifth in pitching, Number 17, Ben Streetman. <laughs> Batting sixth and in center field, number two, Ian Smith. <laughs> Batting second, or seventh, and in right field, number seven, Thomas Daffin. <laughs> Batting eighth, and in left field, number 10, Landon Pugh. Batting ninth, and at third base, number 21, Ethan Roth. And playing first base, number 24, Alex Beard. The Berkeley Bears. And now for the Royal Oak Ravens of head coach, Greg Porter. Leading off at DH, number seven, Brady Shrems. Yeah. Batting second at a shortstop, number three, Andrew Drawbaugh. Yeah. Batting third and catching, number four, Nate Crane. Yeah. Batting fourth and at third base, number 15, Nate Landry. Yeah. Batting fifth and at first base, number 30, Nate Wilms. Batting sixth and at second base, number nine, Parker Lasner. Batting seventh and in right field, number five, Ryan Lasner. Batting eighth and in center field, number 18, Thomas Romito. And batting ninth and in left field, number 10, John Friedrich.
Ladies and gentlemen, we live in a country with freedoms and blessings far beyond our wildest dreams. Indeed, we are living the lives that our forefathers envisioned so long ago. To say thanks to that, to pay homage to that, would you all please rise and join with us in the playing and singing of our national anthem. Thank you. The umpires for today's game are registered by the MHSAA. Their training, experience, knowledge, and integrity make them, make them well qualified to be here and to work this game. And as such, they deserve the utmost respect from the fans, the players, and the coaches. Today is a district semifinal. The Ravens advanced with an opening win over Sterling Heights to get to this point. The Bears had a bye. And the winner of this game will advance to the 2 o'clock district final against the winner of our second game today at noon between two Warren teams, Mott and Cusno. And as we always say before events here at Royal Oak High School, we thank you for your support of these young men and these teams. It's sometimes not easy, especially at 10 o'clock in the morning to get to some of these games on a weekday, but uh, it means a lot to them and it uh, I'm sure means a lot to you, the parents, the grandparents, the guardians. Uh, you're making memories not just for these players, but for yourself. Leading off for the Bears, number four catcher, Spencer Baez. Play 
Batting second for the Bears. At shortstop, number six, Davis O'Donnell. Batting third for the Bears. You gave them the other jug, right? Number five, catcher, Matt DeRozier. Excuse me, second baseman, Matt DeRozier. Batting fourth for the Bears, number nine, D.N. P.H. Aiden Russell. For the Bears, no runs, one hit, no Royal Oak errors after one half inning. It's the Bears nothing, the Ravens coming to bat. I move it, then they're 
Leading off for the Ravens, number seven, D.H. Brady Shrems. Batting second for the Ravens. Number three, shortstop, Andrew Drawball. Batting third for the Ravens. Number four, catcher, Nate Crane. Batting fourth for the Ravens. Number 15, third baseman, Nate Landry. Yeah. 
the curse receiver catch the threat. Keep them on it. Hey, get out. Get out. Yeah, four to two. David, take the easy one. Oh, no, seven Hey, you gotta talk to him. And after one inning, it's nothing, nothing. Again, the winner of this game advances to the district championship game at 2 p.m. against the winner of our second game today. That starts at noon between Warren Mott and Warren Cusno. Leading off for the Bears, number 17 pitcher, Ben Streetman. Runner for the Bears, number 11, Jack Quarterwitz. Batting six for the Bears, number eight. Or excuse me, batting six for the Bears, number two, center fielder Ian Smith. Come on, 
Batting seventh for the Bears, number seven, right fielder Thomas Dawson. For the Bears, number 10 left fielder, Landon Pugh. Yeah, 
Batting ninth for the Bears, number 21, third baseman, Ian Roth. Batting for the Bears, number four, catcher, Spencer Baez. Thank <laughs> you. 
Batting for the Bears, number six shortstop, Davis O'Donnell. Batting for the Bears, number five, second baseman, Matt DeRozier. the Bears, three runs on three hits, one Royal Oak error, and two men left. And after one and one half inning, it's the Bears three, the Ravens nothing. Henry Ford Sports Medicine, official team physicians for over a hundred sports teams in Southeast Michigan and you. We can create a unique game plan for you just like we do for the pros. Learn more at henryford.com backslash sports. Leading off for the Ravens, first baseman number 30, Nate Wilms. Yeah, 
Sixth for the for the Ravens. Number nine, second baseman, Parker Lasner. Let's go, Parker. Come on, what's up? Keep it going. Come on, Seventh for the Ravens, number five, right fielder, Ryan Lasner. For the Ravens, number 18 center fielder Thomas Romito. Hey, watch it go! Watch it go! Let's 
Night for the Ravens, number 10, left fielder John Friedrich. For the Ravens in the second, no runs, one hit, one Berkeley error, two men left, and after two innings of play, it's the Bears three, the Ravens nothing. <laughs> Nearly 1,500 of the state's top student athletes were recognized this year through the Scholar app presented by Farm Bureau Insurance. Visit the MHSAA website for a list of this year's applicants, finalists, and scholarship recipients, and information about the 2022-23 awards program. <laughs> Batting fourth for the Bears. Number nine, D.H. Aiden Russell. for the Bears, number 17 pitcher, Ben Streetman.
Courtesy runner for the Bears, number 11, Jack Porterwich. Coming in the pitch for the Ravens, number 8, Connor Stoyanoff. Batting next for the Bears, number two center fielder Ian Smith. Batting for the Bears, number seven, right fielder Thomas Dauphin. Come on. 
Batting next for the Bears, number 10 left fielder, Landon Pugh. third, no runs, two hits, no Royal Oak errors, and two runners left. After two and a half innings, it's the Bears three, the Ravens nothing. National Guard plays a vital role in our national defense and responds as needed to state emergencies to protect the lives and property of Michigan citizens. If you are interested in learning more about the Guard, visit MyArmyGuard.com. That's MyArmyGuard.com. Leading off for the Ravens, number seven, D.H. Brady Shrimp. Oh, 
Batting next for the Ravens, number three, shortstop, Andrew Drawball. Heading for the Ravens, number four, Nate Crane. Oh, what? 
Courtesy runner for the Ravens, number 12, Mark Say. Batting for the Ravens, number 15, Nate Landry. For the Ravens, no runs, no hits, no Berkeley errors, and one man left. And after three innings, it's the Bears three, the Ravens nothing. Attic Sportswear is proud to be the official custom uniform partner of the Michigan High School Athletic Association. Attics designs, prints, cuts, and sews your custom uniform right here in the United States. With screen printing, embroidery, and sublimation, Attics aims to be your one-stop shop for all your printing needs. Start your custom apparel order today. Visit addixsportswear.com. Batting for the Bears, number 21, Ethan Roth. Batting for the Bears, number four, Spencer Baez. Oh, 
<laughs> Correction, Spencer Baget. Batting for the Bears, number six, Davis O'Donnell. For the Bears, number five, Matt DeRozier. Heading for the Bears, number nine, Aiden Russell.
For the Bears in the fourth, one run, one hit, no Royal Oak errors, and nobody left. And after three and a half innings, it's still the Bears. Now the Bears four, the Ravens nothing. You're a leader in the game, so be a leader in your school by using OK to say you can report anything that threaten, threatens your safety or the safety of others. Submit a confidential tip 24-7 by phone, text, email, online, or through the mobile app. By using OK to say, you can make a difference. Yeah, you thought he was moving forward on that? Or? No, no, no. Oh, yeah. Just using it. Sure, sure. As a lefty, he's got that prerogative. Yeah. Yeah. If you got something weird, we'll grab it. No, something weird at all. Let's go, William. Batting for the Ravens, number thirty, Nate Wilms. Number nine, Parker Lasner. One hit, no Berkeley errors, and nobody left. And after four innings, it's two outs. Two outs. 
Two out. Jumping it. Batting for the Ravens, number five, Ryan Lazarus. For the Ravens in the first, the fourth, no runs, one hit, no Berkeley errors, and nobody left. And after four innings, it's the Bears four, the Ravens nothing. Every day in Michigan, investigators work hard to keep people safe on the internet. For more information on how to keep your family safe online or submit a cyber tip, visit michiganicac.com. Leading off the Bears in the fifth inning, number nine, Aiden Russell. Batting for the Bears, number 17, Ben Streetman. Let me trade with you. 
Batting for the Bears, number two, Ian Smith. Batting for the Bears, number seven, Thomas Dawson. For the Bears in the fifth, no runs, one hit, one rail oak error, and one man left. Going into the bottom of the fifth, it's still the Bears four, the Ravens nothing. Do you need money for college? Students in the class of 2023 are encouraged to apply for the Michigan Achievement Scholarship, which could provide up to $5,500 per year. Learn more today at michigan.gov backslash achievement. Leading off the bottom of the fifth for the Ravens, number 18, Thomas Romito. Let's go, 
Batting for the Ravens, number 10, John Friedrich. Batting for the Ravens, number seven, Brady Schrems. Batting for the Ravens, number three, Andrew Drawball. For the Ravens, number four, Nate Crane. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. 
Courtesy runner for the Ravens, number 12, Mark Say. Betting for the Ravens, number 15, Nate Landry.
Batting for the Ravens, number 30, Nate Will. for the Ravens, number nine, Parker Lasner. in the fifth inning, three runs on three hits, one Berkeley error and two runners left. We've completed five innings, and it's the Bears four, the Ravens three. Applebee's invites you to eat good in the neighborhood after every game. Join us for late night half off appetizers at participating locations. Applebee's, proud sponsor and official restaurant of the MHSAA. Now pitching for the Ravens, number 15, Nate Landry. Leading off of the Bears, number 10, Landon Pugh.
Bang for the Bears, number 21, Ethan Roth. Now playing third base for the Ravens, number six, Jack Groya. Batting for the Bears, number four, Spencer Bajish. Batting for the Bears, number six, Davis O'Donnell. For the Bears in the sixth, no runs, one hit, no Royal Oak errors, and one runner left. And we completed five and a half innings. It's the Bears four, the Ravens three. Chocolate milk has essential nutrients every athlete needs, not typically found in traditional sports drinks. Next time you grab a beverage, whether it's in the lunchroom, out on the field, or at home, remember to rethink your drink and pick chocolate milk. Chocolate milk is the official beverage of the Michigan High School Athletic Association. Leading off the sixth inning for the Ravens, number five, Ryan Lasner. Go, Ryan! Go, Lasner! Let's start here, Ryan. Come on. Go, Ryan! Put on the street! 
Batting for the Ravens, number 18, Thomas Romito. For the Bears, number five, Matt DeRozier. <laughs> now playing third base for the Bears, number 22, Nick Campbell. John Friedrich. Let's go! Hey, let's go, Johnny! Hey, 
break, Ken. Come on. for the Ravens, number seven, Brady Schrems. Betting for the Ravens, number four, Nate Crane. For the Ravens in the six, no run, one hit, one Berkeley error, and three men left. And after six innings, it's still the Bears four, the Ravens three.
From the biggest stadiums in the state to the familiar fields down the street, Meyer is a proud sponsor of local sports teams across the Midwest. Whenever you shop Meyer, you help support the teams that bring us together and the values that our community is proud to stand for. You help support your community, including local sports teams, education programs, the arts, food pantries, and more programs that bring out the very best in all of us. From the biggest of big games to the littlest of the little, Meyer is proud to sponsor this game and hundreds of local sports teams across Michigan. Matt DeRozier. Ready for the Bears, number nine, Aiden Russell.
Batting for the Bears, number 17, Ben Treatman. Batting for the Bears, number two, Ian Smith. Batting for the Bears, number seven, Thomas Goffin. For the Bears in the seventh, no runs, one hit, no Royal Oak errors, and two men left. We go to the bottom of the seventh, and it's the Bears four, the Ravens three. Nearly 1,500 of the state's top student athletes were recognized this year through the Scholar Athlete Award presented by Farm Bureau Insurance. Visit the MHSAA website for a list of this year's applicants, finalists, and scholarship recipients and information about the 2022-23 awards program. Let's go, we're 
Leading off for the Ravens in the bottom of the seventh. Number 15. Ryan Lasner. for the Ravens, number 30, Nate Wilms. Number five, Ryan Lazar. For the Ravens in the seventh, no runs, two hits. One birthday error and one man left. And the Ra and the Bears have win the game four to three. They punch their ticket to this afternoon's district championship game. The winning pitcher for the Bears, number 17, Ben Streetman.